because she wanted to spend time with the baby, and then she went back to school, right? And that's just what she did. She was not conferred hero status. There was a girl in her class who was a single mother and had to work her way through being a single mother. And she's granted this sort of hero status. Oh, look at all the challenges she's had to overcome. Right, challenges that she made for herself. I'm glad she overcame them. It would have been better if she didn't make the challenges for herself in the first place. We need to stop creating heroes out of people who make poor decisions. Right? It's great that you can overcome a challenge, but don't create challenges for yourself and then be celebrated for the challenges that you created for yourself. So you know, incentivizing fathers to stay in the home would be a massive thing. And again, if, if there's one thing that's leading to, to crime in the black community right now, it is the escalating rate of single motherhood, because that's true in every community that has high crime rates. It has high rates of single motherhood for a very specific reason. Young men commit crimes. Young men are not afraid of their mothers. Right? Every guy in this audience right now knows that at age 15, if your mom told you to cut it out, the chances were she was going to have to call your dad. Right? The fact is, young men do not fear a, 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 an authority structure that comes from mom. It's just not the way that it works. So you know, that's, they, there are many things that Black Lives Matter actually could do if they, if they actually believed 